Version 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, there's the main little Arctic cold front sliding eastward, and the cold air is rushing in. So a little bit of this is changing to a brief light wintry mix in our eastern counties. And I have noticed in the past hour, there are reports of some light patchy freezing drizzle in eastern Illinois. So that may move into the viewing area this evening. With temps dropping below freezing, watch out for a couple slick spots. And also, any moisture on the pavement will start to freeze too. So there will be a few slick spots here and there. And with that, also some snow showers. These are pivoting in from the northwest, about to move into Newton and Jasper and Benton counties here soon. And farther west, there are additional snow showers. You can see the leading edge near Watsika right now, approaching Kentland and Brook at the present time. And as we look westward, you can see additional patches of flurries and scattered snow showers. So these will kind of pivot in like that. And then all of these flurries and snow showers will pivot in like that. So we're going to have these tonight. We'll have them tomorrow as well. And if there's any accumulation, it'd be the grass whitened, maybe the pavement whitened in a few places. But again, it doesn't take very much to create a few slick spots. Freezing right now at the station, 33 Monticello, 34 Winamax, still 35 Peru, but down to 31 degrees at Fowler. Now, the big weather story, much colder air, along with the river flooding. River's cresting uh, either near flood stage or a few feet above that from Lafayette uh, down to Covington, uh, specifically uh, on the Wabash. And a lot of the creeks and streams are still pretty high, but they'll start to come down. With the scattered snow showers and flurry action in the forecast and wind chills dropping back below zero. And speaking of those wind chills, yeah, they're headed our way tonight. 20 by 2 a.m., but 18 at 6, and a wind chill down to 1 below zero. Tomorrow, with a pretty windy day, temps in the teens to lower 20s, and notice the wind chills zero to about two above during the day. And there's a Another look at lows tonight area wide, generally in the teens, 19 Frankfurt, 17 Monticello, Lafayette. And tomorrow, pretty close to 20, 20 Remington, 21 Lafayette, 23 Thorntown, Frankfurt. Pretty bitter day, really bitter day Friday with a pretty stiff wind from the northwest and highs only in the teens area wide from 14 at Rensselaer to 18 at Ladoga. So some scattered snow showers and flurries through the night. And even though Futurecast doesn't really paint anything tomorrow morning or tomorrow, there will still be a few snow showers and flurries hanging around the area with the cold temperatures. There's 4 p.m. We'll have mostly cloudy skies tomorrow, but with clearing skies tomorrow night, we drop into the single digits and then we head for a partly cloudy Friday. By Saturday, Clipper drops in. Some light snow is possible. We'll keep an eye on that. Looks like we may have just a little very minor accumulation, but it doesn't look like a big deal. Maybe the grass whitened from that in places. 7 day forecast though, no significant snow in the forecast. 32 Sunday, 40 Monday, perhaps a very light wintry mix, even a few rain showers, mainly the early half of Tuesday with a high of 35. So I tell you what, it is going to feel rough out there tomorrow with the winds and 21 for tomorrow night and 16 for the high on Friday. Yeah, what a way to end the week, right? Yeah. When we got up to 65. Hey, yeah, after <laughs> breaking a record yesterday. Right. All right.